Hey, good morning, everybody, or hello on this Friday when you see this. This is Sports Live and ATL. David here. Uh, hope everybody's having a great week. I'm back on the grind starting tomorrow. Uh, but I am. You know, the schedule, uh, my work schedule is the same basically every week. So I will be uh, doing something Saturday night. Not sure yet. I'm trying to see if I can maybe put something on the channel. Um, I don't know. Uh, as far as Sunday, I'm not sure about that either. Because uh, since the Falcons aren't playing, I'm just going to spend all day probably watching football and all the games and just, you know, perusing around the thing. So, uh, but thanks, everybody, hope er for being still supportive of my channel. I hope everybody has had a fabulous week. I know I've had my ups. I've had my downs. I've had more ups than downs. Uh, and and uh, I, I feel good. I did some breaking away from this channel. Did some stuff on my other channel. Um, you know, just some music. You know, and some opinions and stuff like that. But uh, um, going to get back at it uh, starting Sunday night, probably, because the Falcons are playing the Saints on uh, next next uh, Sunday at one o'clock. I will be streaming that game, and I know it's going to be popping. So I do want to go ahead and give uh, a couple shouts right now to Forty Four Legendary Noah, JP of the New Orleans Saints, Algiers is back, Monet Five Hundred Four. I'm pretty sure he'll come out. Uh, Mr. Hudat, Chris Fields, Joshua Gus, and 504 Hudat. That's all I know right now. And, oh, and Jordan um, Jordan Dog, uh, Saints fan. So it's going to be a fun week for me. Again, I want to go and let everybody know, it's not going to be some verbal uh, trash-talking hate week thing. That's not what I do. Now, if you're coming on there for that, you're going to be disappointed. However, I will show my passion on, on my displeasure of the Saints and what they've done and their fans and, and all this and that. Uh, so don't think that it's not going to be entertaining, but don't expect uh, to have verbal job, uh, jabs all week long. It's not going to happen. I plan on hopefully uh, having a New Orleans Saints video maker, a reputable one, on, uh, on, on my channel Wednesday to talk Saints-Falcons football because um, that to me it's the best rivalry that there is in the National Football League is the Falcons and the Saints, whether it's here in Atlanta or like it's going to be next Sunday in New Orleans. So that's, that's just my own personal thing, and uh, I love this rivalry. It brings out the best and, and myself um, just because I, I just enjoy it. You know, I have a lot of good positives about me, but uh, just when it comes to the Falcons and the Saints, it just gets me. But we'll talk about that uh, later in the week. I'm trying just, like I said, stay away from it pretty much this week. I've gone to a couple streams. JP, give a shout out to you. That was a fun stream last night for the time I was in there um, and everything. So, uh, but anyways, uh, this is Road to 3K. Um, it's been kind of slow this week. <coughs> Haven't done many videos or streams or anything, so... You know, hopefully back at it. Please hit the click the subscribe button if you haven't. If you're new, uh, click click the like button, share, subscribe, share it to your media outlets, and please click the notification bell so you'll know when my content uploads and everything. Um, I will be doing the Stephen Rose tournament picks tomorrow uh, after work, probably tomorrow night. Uh, I'll do that maybe by eight o'clock or something like that. Get the tournament picks out of the way. Uh, I did pick the. I think I picked the Titans last night. Don't know who won. I was busy, but uh, yeah, just wanted to put that in there. But this right here is going to be a review video. It's it's a review video of some. Now this is something different. I tried to get Axe, but I wanted to try this. Um, right here, because for those of you who follow me a lot, I love Axe body spray. Um, I really do, and. When I went into uh, the store yesterday, I came across this Adidas Fill the Impact. It's got body spray, body wash, etc. Um, right here. Uh, I thought I saw some Axe. I think I meant to pick up Axe. I'm not sure. I might go back in there this week and uh, pick up the Axe box. I think it's the same price, but you know, this is something to try. It's aftershave, body hair face three and one which i love those actually um and deodorant body spray deodorant there's nothing look uh, when you get out of the shower and you put on a good deodorant body spray 
it feels really good. It smells good. It, it lingers. And because um, I like to smell good personally. Now, you might say to yourself, is this sports oriented? Yes, it is. I would think athletes wear deodorant. I would think athletes wear body spray. God forbid you sh a lot of y'all should. And then uh, we got the whatever that is. Team Force Stimulating, Team Force Stimulating, whatever. But this is, like I said, and what I'm going to do is this week I'm going to go get um, the, the, the Axe one. I think I saw Axe, and I will do a review on that one. Because, you know, like I said, all this stuff is sports oriented because, you know, you got to wear deodorant. You got to smell good even on the field or basketball court or whatever. Um, nothing like playing against other grown men and then smelling like underarm. Just disgusting. Um, and also, if you care to support the channel, I do have Cash App and PayPal. PayPal will be posted uh, a little bit during this premiere. I will attach it to my to my description. If you uh, care to uh, support the show that way, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, PayPal and Cash App, and I have Super Chat as well, and I do not mention that at all during my games or my streams. I will post links throughout, but that's to the extent of it. Uh, but anyway, let's get to this. Uh, Adidas, fill the impact. Unopened. Let's see what this is about. I uh, just got done taking a shower. Uh, so, I haven't yet put on this because I wanted to try it here. Okay, Team Force Stimulating. This is Shower Gel. So, I'm guessing Shower Gel is after. So, it's giving me three different ways to smell good with this. So, let me open this. what it looks like. Uh, the Shower Gel by Adidas. Comment below. Let me know what you use. Uh, I do find that ladies really enjoy... A guy who smells good. Well, ladies, trust me, we enjoy a woman who smells good too. But let me smell and see what this smells like. How do you open? Okay. It smells good. Get a little bit of texture of it. See what let's see what it looks like. Right there. Hmm. Since I already took a shower, I'll just put it right here. It's got a good smell to it. Kind of orangey-ish. Kind of warm. Actually, no wonder it's called orange extract. I like the smell. It smells good right here. So there's one. Uh, and then we got what I enjoy a lot of, body spray. Sometimes I tend to put on too much of this, but I like to smell good. So I'm going to put some on now. Uh, this is Adidas Team Force body spray. It says, uh, a loose salt cell under 48 hour, 48 hour fragrance. And I like to smell good all day long. So let me go ahead and... Interesting smell. I'll put this on here. I'm not going to do it on cam. I don't want y'all to see all this. Hmm. Mm, smells good too. And what I do when I do body spray, I rub it all over... Because I like it to get into all the areas. So Let me smell that. Mm, that smells good too. So walking around the neighborhood, uh, I can wear that. And that's this. Adidas body spray. Again, I will go and I will get the, uh, um, of the uh, Axe one this week. This right here is Adidas Aftershave Team Force. Okay, I got, they actually gave me two bottles of the shower gel. So it came with two bottles of the shower gel. Now this is the Adidas. Kind of looks like it's a colonist style. But we'll see what this is. No, it's not a drink in a paper bag. But this is what it looks like right there. See what this smells like. Because mm. I do get some bumps here because I do use, I don't use a razor. I use the... Uh, you know, the shaver, electric shaver, and I do get bumps from time to time. So this is probably a good thing to uh, to weed that out. I like the smells, actually. They smell good. They do. They smell really good. And, again, this is brought to you by, again, they didn't ask me to do this. This is on a whim. I see a lot of people do reviews out there. And, like I said, I do, when, I'm, when, I, when I was playing basketball and sports periodically and exercising at the gym, I still wear body sprays and, and gels and stuff because I like to smell good. You know, 
one of the gems. Once I'm, a, I'm gonna get back to it once this thing is over with, hopefully, which is soon. Um, I mean, I work out here, but it's nothing like working at a, out at a gym. Some of my friends are still doing it. They asked me to go, but I'm like, I'm not sure, because uh, I don't know if I could work with a work out with a mask on. But I'm anxious to get back for sure. But in some gyms, when they got showers. I do this. You know, there's nothing worse than when you're at a gym and somebody's working out and their sweat is all over the place and they're dripping and then they get a shower. They forget to put on deodorant. You got to smell good. You got to smell good for yourself. You got to smell good for, for, for the women. You got to smell good for the people around you and for the equipment. I mean, there's nothing, trust me, there's nothing worse than, than a horrible smelling person at the gym. C4. So this is what it is right here, ladies and gentlemen, right there. That's the Adidas. The Adidas collection right there. All right, along with my C4, give them a little shout. So I recommend if you go to, I, I got it from Walmart. It was an $18 value for $9.88. Because right now I'm on a budget right now. I had to pay for a lot of things, so I'm not out to spend tons of money. Because usually if you get, if you get like a body spray, it's like $4 and something. Um... And then if you get aftershave, it can be like three, four, five, six dollars if you want to get some good stuff a little bit pricier. And shower gel bottles usually are about four and a half dollars. So you're looking at you could be spending twenty plus dollars for four things, twenty-five dollars, and I got all this and uh, for nine dollars and eighty-eight cents plus tax. So I, I can't complain. It was worth it to get. And yeah. Smells good too. Maybe I'll go walk around the neighborhood. You know. Ladies, come on out. Yeah, it's got a good good smell. But you don't want to put on too much because you don't want to smell like a like somebody just threw a truck of a, a truck of spray all over you because then I mean the other such thing is putting too much on. I kinda have been guilty of it in the past. <laughs> so but interesting. I like the smell. Again, I thought it was uh, axe when I first picked it up because I think I saw an axe um, display. So I will peek at that this week. Probably, I don't know. I'll wait until this goes out. Actually, I probably should go get it as soon as possible so it doesn't run out. Uh, I think it kind of has the same things as this. So th this will tie me over for a bit, though. Um, so comment below, everybody. Let me know what you use. Let me know if there's any body sprays, gels. Um, body sprays and gels predominantly, or body wash, predominantly go for the guys and women. I don't think many women use aftershave uh, lotion, you know, aftershave stuff, even for what you do. I don't think so. I could be wrong. Um, but, uh, and then the three in one, like I said, this is the body hair face. So this is that shower gel body wash. I still have my own body wash. I have a couple containers of body wash that I have from Suave and from Axe, and I'll use those still. Uh, even when I'm using this because I think when you take a shower you want to smell the best the freshness the best you can coming out um, So I pretty much just put a lot of stuff on after the shower especially after I shave uh, I feel good. I feel comfortable. I feel confident um, You'd be surprised you smell good. You walk around with a lot more swag I'm just telling straight like it is. I mean, I'm always I'm a confident individual anyway But I know when you smell good you 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 bring off that comfortable vibe and then you know women will come to you because they like the smell it's their starting point and you can just feel good in what you're doing even if you're doing a lot of physical activities you don't feel like horrible uh, and everything because there are some people that i work around that probably should be using some of these if not all seriously so but anyway that's it for this video this premiere everybody and maybe up to my 15 16 minutes uh, i just wanted to do a review on this again if you have any questions comments this is a sporting a video because this is sports wear, sports smells, because athletes do use this. Uh, I know a lot of people, athletes who use these kind of things in their daily lives and uh, when they're playing sports because you can't be going on the football field, the basketball court, the hockey rink, the baseball diamond smelling like, smelling just like you just got out of a garbage can. So smell is important even in the sports world. Trust me, take it from me. Uh, and it's a good thing to use when you're going to the gym and after your workouts as well. So this is this one. If you got a Walmart around your area, 
go check this out. Let me know what you think. Do a review video on it. Uh, let me know you did one. I'll peek it out. And then I'll be doing the um, Axe one at some point soon. And uh, yeah, getting back to normal. Again, if you watch this archive and you're new, click the subscribe button, please. Road to 3K, it's the red button. Click the notification bell, share to your media outlets, and hit the like button and everything. And I do appreciate it. Thank you very much, uh, Sports Live and ATL David. Until the next video, everybody has a great, hope everybody has a great rest of your Friday. Going into your weekend, I go back to work tomorrow. Thank God, I'm kind of ready to get out and you know with my people again uh, and do what I got to do because uh, bills don't stop. Bills don't stop, and so got to make that money to to pay the bills. So, Sports Avenue ATL, I'll see you in the next one.